Welcome back to another video where we explore how to have fun using AI. Now there are a bunch of different tools out there that aren't just for business or marketing or tech. This is a video where we explore the different AIs out there that allow us to have fun. So this is the second time we've done a video like this. So go check out the first video for more ideas on how to have fun with AI. The first one we have here today is auto draw. Now, what it does is it, com it basically completes, if I start to draw a circle, it's gonna come up across here and give us a few ideas. So it looks like, okay, it thinks the moon, fantastic. So then I'm gonna draw a rocket, hold up, and we might be able to find a rocket ship. How cool is this? This is an absolutely incredible tool. Auto draw. The second tool I wanna to check out is uh, Meme Cam. So basically, you can use a camera or upload an image. For this instance, I can't use my camera because I'm recording with my computer here. I'm gonna upload an image. I'm gonna upload an image of my podcast. So it's probably gonna <laughs> make fun of me. Let's see what happens. Please don't make fun of me. Oh, they're under heavy low. When you finally find the missing piece to the puzzle, what makes you happy? So that's not really a meme but it has potential. What happened? Oh, it's generating another one. I want it to absolutely like rip me a new one, like a classic meme. This is one of those things you could get uh, like a, a really drunk picture of one of your close friends that app just looks munted and just paste that in. You would get probably a really good spot. When you finally remember where you left your keys. Okay, now fair play, fair play. So it can create some stuff. So it's got potential. Meme cam, check it out. One that I'm pretty interested in, movie and book recommender. So if you're like me, I don't watch a lot of movies because I have a particular taste. I'm the kind of person, I think it's an ADHD trait where I watch the same thing over and over again because it's more comfortable. So with this, and the same thing, I, I've got a, I'm the massive fan of the Rangers Apprentice book series, right? And I have an entire box set of these books. To me, I've never read anything better. So let's check this out, Rangers Apprentice. It might come back as a, a favorite book book recommender. It might come back as uh, The Assassin's Apprentice. We'll see. Or it's going to completely throw us off left field and give me something I'm probably not even remotely interested in. So it looks like right now movie and book recommender isn't working. Human or not. Now we can definitely have some fun with this. So the whole goal is to chat with someone for two minutes and try to figure out if it was a fellow human or AI bot. Searching for a partner. Now this could actually mess with us. There could definitely not be anyone. Uh, Godzilla, I don't know why I'm doing Godzilla. Yeah, sort of. King Kong is cool. I think this is AI, hands down, the king of monsters. That's a question. Yes, of course everyone knows that Godzilla is the king of monsters. A general person would probably say Godzilla is pretty sick, right? The king of monsters is an AI response. Hands down, I win. You ain't getting me. I see, I'm, I'm unaware about these topics. Bang, that is AI, of course. So I can tell that you're AI. I win. I win. I win. The other side is left. AI, for sure. What? Huh? Okay, so that's pretty interesting. So you can see how that could be fun. You could have some pretty interesting conversations and I've just been really completely fooled by this person's responses. I guess I don't know everything. The next one we have is extrapolate. Now, basically, see how well we age with AI. So if I can upload a photo of myself, we can see what, what I actually look like in a few years time. I reckon I'm just gonna be all grayed in, wrinkled here, wrinkled in the forehead. All these AI tools are loading. All right, we're loaded. Look, check it. God, it's aging me pretty bad. Jeez, the young version, is it, it's kind of realistic, I see it. All I can say is my teeth look really good as I age. That is something I'm incredibly happy about and I don't lose my hair. Win. And then last but not least for this video, we have a vocal remover and isolation. So basically a separated voice from music out of a song free with powerful AI algorithms. So we can just throw in this meme song that we created in the last video. <laughs> and take Jerry's voice of the coffee song and hopefully separate it into just the audio. Okay, this is cool. So we could, you could potentially create remixes with this, karaoke's with this. Oh, this has got some crazy potential. Karaoke. Okay, this tool has potential. Vocalremover.org, check 
this out if you're looking to have some fun with some audio and create your own create your own music, sing some karaoke, mess around with some songs. So that is it for this video on how to have fun with AI. Yet again, if you like this video here, please smash that subscribe button and like the video, but also leave me a comment of any fun AI tools that you've been experimenting with lately. And if you'd like to see more videos, like, click that here. My name's Jake Pearson, and we'll see you in the next video.